I dropped my mic. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Phoenix and uh, today I'm going to do something a little different than just reading random uh, Wattpad or talk about total drama. I'm instead going to be flexing. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to be talking about all the, the Hasman Hotel and Hell of a Boss merch that I have. Because I just kind of want to share it with everyone. Because some of this stuff is kind of hard to get information about. So I just want to like do my own little part for the, the community. And just kind of just show off what the collection of all the official stuff is. So if you're trying to collect what I collect, then you know what to do, you know? I think I started around 2019... I saw on their Twitter that they were doing a pre-order for Fat Nuggets, and I was like, I have to get this. And I think that's where my collection started, and then I got the shirt, and then I fully decided about which characters I wanted to do around, I believe it was the 2021 um, merch drop of Halloween. So that's what I decided to, to focus on certain characters and just get merch of them. So, and since then, my collection has grown a lot, so I just want to share with you guys what I have. So I'll just be doing it on sections based off of like mugs, prints, it's a skateboard, and then we'll do the pins at the end because there's so many. <laughs> just to make it easier for everyone to follow at home, I will have chapters. So so if you just want to see a certain section, it'll be in the description for you to follow along. So all right. So I want to do the fan made stuff first because it's kind of interesting because I don't have a lot of fan made stuff. I think I just have five, so, but the, the ones that I do have, they're all pretty high quality, so I just want to share that now before we get into the official stuff for you to watch out for, but I highly recommend if you find these people on like Etsy or another source, definitely buy one. I really like these products. So we have, our, this is an Angel Dust standee, uh, I don't know if you can see that. <laughs> But it's double-sided, and it just features Angel Dust doing a little Valentine's Day kind of thing. Uh, I don't know if this was for Valentine's Day, but I, I love it. <laughs> it. Angel Dust doesn't have a lot of standees right now compared to Stolas and Octavia. So I got this one for Christmas, I believe, for my boy's parents. So that must have been weird to purchase for, for them. And then I got a plush. This is little baby Stolas. He's on Etsy. He's so cute. He's based off of the one in the circus episode. Maybe just a bit younger than the one that actually walks and talks and whatever thing. But he's very soft. He's very he's very cute. Look at the little owl boy. He's got a little tail too. <laughs> and then let me see if I can find my keys. So I do have a keychain on here, and I'll I'll discuss the lanyard later on. But I got this at I believe GalaxyCon. I got this one, like, it's just double-sided with angel dust. That one's really cute as well. Yeah, he's, just, he's just a little guy. Just a, just a small little guy. And then the last two fan-made stuff that I have, I actually requested from a good friend of mine. So I recommend checking them out. I will have it down in the description. They're really good at art. So I just want to show off the pieces if you have... If you're interested in buying them from their Etsy shop, or if you want to commission them for something else, but but here's the I believe it's the first one I asked for. This is a commission of Stolas and his little imp buddy as well. Little cute, little cute baby. I I was like I really want like a baby Stolas, but I didn't know what, so I just looked up like royal children and I found like a cute thing where this baby was playing with like a teddy bear and I was like perfect so that's him I would have this on my wall right now but I can't hang up anything so it's kind of just chilling on my dresser for right now and then we have our final product and this is a little angel dust with fat nuggets he's kind of just holding them all nice this is all from the same artist this is from Astro Gummy so I highly recommend checking them out. They, they're they really good at what they do. And they have other stuff. They don't just do Old Boss and Has Been Hotel. But that's what I just commissioned them for. Also, I don't think I said this. Uh, I mainly collect from... For Has Been Hotel, I collect mainly Angel Dust and Fat Nuggets. And then from Hell of a Boss, I do Stolas and Octavia. 
So I just have mainly merch of them, and if other characters come along as well, I collect them as well, unfortunately. So if there's a Blitz and Stolas pairing for like a pin or something, I have it. So not the worst thing in the world. I think the next thing I want to show off is these playing cards. I believe they were first announced on Twitter. They didn't do like an official video for them, and I think it sold out in like 15 minutes. So... It was released, and then I got these on the Black Friday drop when they discounted them. So let me open it so I can show you guys. So some of these cards are very, like, have their own different designs, especially like the, it's the Jack, Queens, Kings, and Aces that have different designs. I don't think the, the I don't think two through nine do anything, but. All right, let's see. You open this. Yeah, this real. There we go. Now I believe this is just the the has been crew. Okay, so you, for jokers you have like the exterminators, and then Ace you got like Charlie, in there. Where's Angel? That's what we want. Oh, that's mother. There's Cherry Bomb. Ah, here it is. Here's our boy Angel right there. He's one of the, the Jack of Hearts. Oh, there's Velvet, too. And Oh, okay. I love the symbols on here. This is my first time seeing this. <laughs> I don't know who that is. Let me know who that is. I don't know who that is. Maybe it's just a demon form of Charlie. Could be. But yeah. Definitely, I think it's still up on the shop, so highly recommend getting that. Let me put this back in here so it doesn't get ruined. All right, and since they're right next to me, I guess I'll do the plushies next. I, I have four. They're both official. This is the first one in my collection. It's little fat nuggets. He did. I did get the pin that came with him, but I'll show that off later. But I love the amount of detail on him. He's got all these little spots all over him. He's got his little tag so you know that he's official. And I love his pretty tail like a little piggy. Because he's a little piggy. He's got a little dot. It would have been really funny if they had just had like a heart at the, at the very belly. But he's very cute. Very soft. Very squishy. <laughs> Alright. And then you can't have fat nuggets without angel dust. He was the first plushie to be released, I believe, in 2019, and he's been out of stock ever since <laughs> for, like, a while. So, yeah, he's got his little boots. He's got, he, they just put him with four arms instead of six. And he's got the little gold tooth, the gold tooth in his little eyes. And on the back, he's got a little heart. So, I love the amount of detail. They could have just, like, did it all white. I could put him right here and be like, yeah, he's right him. Alright, and then we have our has been hotel crew right here. Um, I did not get the bundle when they did the announcement for, I believe, Stolas, Octavia, and Robo Frizz, because I didn't have money at the time. So I got these later when they were released separately, but I do have the pins from a different seller that was selling them off. So I'm not proud of that, but, but first we have Stolas. I believe his cape is removable, but I'm not going to try. He's got his little crown, which if you tug it down, they got more detail on the crown. So, his little eyes, his little scuff, which I can't, I think it goes inside instead of outside. And then his feet, I still had a tag on it, of it being official from Shark Robot. Yeah, definitely get him from the website if he's available. Um... There's a lot of people on eBay selling, like, a, like a knockoff where the face is kind of, like, messed up. So, just be aware of that. There are knockoffs. <laughs> Come right there in the middle frame. And then we have Octavia, the squirrel. She had a little hat. I love her hair. It's very soft right here. I wasn't expecting it to be so soft. Um, my only problem with it is that, I guess, the beanie, it tips a little flare. Like, I don't know if you can see it on the camera. But he's got, she's got a little, like, I don't know what they are. They're just from, like, getting collected with, like, little white um, lines or, like, fizz. That's my only complaint about it. But her coat is removable. I've done it several times. And so, so it's just, like, a sleeve right there. 
She's got her little owl tail. And she just sits nicely. And I, I like how they did they did bother to give her a second eye as well. Alright, I think next what I'm going to do is show off the switch cases that I have. Uh, this first one I'm going to show off is not actually mine. It's my boy's. But I did get him this one. I believe this came out for the Black Friday drop. And it just shows Moxie and Millie just being a cute couple on there. This actually is pretty high quality. I like the one that I have, which I'll show off later, which was my first one. But it's really high quality. I expected this to be like, um, if there wasn't anything in there, like a switch, it would kind of like fold in and be really soft. But it's actually really durable. That Mine hasn't broken and his hasn't broken yet at all. But let me open it to show you guys the inside. Yeah, so it just has like a little pocket for you to put like the accessories. So like the, uh, like the... The little things that go on the Joy-Cons. You can put like up to 10 games on here. And then they have like security for your Switch. Just in case it's open so it doesn't like fall out of break. So very, very high quality on that one. Now my first one is the Fat Nuggets one with Angel Dust. And this one I realized how high quality it was as well. I believe this came out in the Summer Drop. So... Yeah, and I, this is the first one to sell out. I believe they still have the Charlie and Vaggie, and then Charlie and Alistair one as well. So highly recommend getting one of those. I don't know if this will ever come back. Hopefully it will, because it sold out pretty quickly. But I don't know anyone that's selling it secondhand, but it's just mine. It's just mine. And then this one also came out for the Black Friday drop. It is Stolos and Blitz on here. Um, I love how they just, like didn't use the same design, you know? They got two different designs for Stolas and then two different designs for Blitz as well. And I love the color palette that they used on here. They, I believe the artist that did these showed off the original sketches. Um, let's see, for the Fat Nuggets one, I believe they put orange in here and I feel like that would have been really nice to see, like a little contrast to it, but these are pretty good. Alright, these next ones that I have are I have only two of them. I do not have the Fat Nuggets and Angel Dust one right now. I'll probably purchase it later. But these are the two th ones that I have, and they are the backpacks. This one I'm actually currently using right now. It has Stolas and Octavia on it as little constellations. So I love that she's included. I, did, I forgot that she was included. <laughs> not that I forgot. It just says it as Stolas' as constellation, so I thought Stolas would be all over this thing. But they have little Octavia on there too. She's really cute. And then you got little little Stolas right here too. They're actually really nice. And um It feels it feels nice to hold. It's not like a bad texture. And then you also got like the front pocket, which continues some of the design in here as well. So nice storage space, and they have this big one as well. Which I just have just my wallet. <laughs> And they also have like the like cup holders or something like if you need to just put like something in there for quick access without the zipper. So that's nice. They have the two on each side. And then this one I ordered myself. And it has the same kind of qualities as the other one. Like front pocket, big pocket, and then a two on the side. Um, I did start using this one when I first got it. It's pretty nice. It has the same design as the one on the Switch case as well for the complete Black Friday drop. But this one is limited edition, but I believe it's still on the website, so if you do want it, it's still on there. But I used this one first, and then I went to a Squirtle backpack, and then I went to this one right here. So maybe after I'm done using that one, I'll order the Fat Nuggets one. But this will be warm when, you're, when you get the backpacks in. And they're really going to be really squished, so it's going to take some time for it to really structure, but after it really structured, it's, it's pretty durable now. Like, it, it looks like a backpack. Okay, I think the next thing that I want to show you guys is the shirts that I have, because I have a lot now. I usually, when, when they do merch drops, they do, like, limited runs of the shirts, and I usually ask either my boy or my friends to just pick out whichever shirt, because I'm, I'm not really worried about them. If I, if I don't get one, it's fine, but, but the ones I do have, I'm really proud of. This was actually my first shirt that I got. It's <laughs> it's worn down now because it's been through a lot of washes, but it has like the moment from episode two of season one where Stolas and little Octavia are on the meteor and she's and he's singing her a lullaby and everything. So 
This one, I really liked it, so I was like, I gotta get that one. <laughs> so this one I actually purchased. <laughs> Let's see. I'm just gonna grab a random one and start talking about it. So this one is Summer Stolas. This came out on summer of 2022. I've loved the color palette, that like how they made Stolas this nice purple and used the pink accents and everything. It fits really nice with this character. Uh, a friend got this for me for my birthday, which ended up being like, came like two months later because <laughs> of the, the shipping thing. Because they usually start shipping. This is up to eight weeks on the website, so yeah, it took a little bit. Now this one's cute. This one, I believe, is is the glow-in-the-dark one. This is the fat nugget. Yeah, this one's glow-in-the-dark, so it doesn't, like, it, when you first get one of these, like, glow-in-the-dark ones, they don't really glow-in-the-dark, so I would just recommend putting it through a wash first, and then it'll really start to glow-in-the-dark. But it shows Fat, like, oh, Fat Nuggets is a witch, just just doing some spells. <laughs> this one came out in Halloween of 2022, so newer design. Very, very cute. Should probably fold these up nicely so I can put them like later. Now I'll be honest with you, I forgot when I got this. <laughs> um, I believe I got it Black Friday of 2021. I remember my my mom got it for me because it was the one thing I was like super excited about. So nice little like Octavia listening to music on her little like phone or just in in the mood. So very, very nice one. You, you can see where I start wearing shirts a lot because they start looking like this, start fading, and they got the little cracks. Now this one was cool. I believe I got this one, like the one, the Black Friday ones. I believe it was Black Friday of 2021, and it has Stolas with the, the some of the lyrics from Everything Will Be Okay. So you got like little bits of the lyrics on here that fall through, and then the big one as well. Very nice. I believe they have like an Alistair one of this as well, where it has a silhouette and he's like, you're not fully dressed without a smile. That one's really cool. Unfortunately, not that big of a fan of Alistair to, to get that, but very nice nonetheless. Now, this one's the most recent one to my collection. I saw this one was Last Chance and I begged for it, so I got it. <laughs> this one is Angel Dust's Big Getaway. And it shows little angel dust there, and then he's got fat nuggets in the in the driver's seat of him just shooting bullets and getting away. This one's very like vibrant color. I don't know when this design first came out. I think it was one of the first designs on the website when they were doing the whole merch thing. So it's a shame that it's on last chance now, and no one will be able to get it. But it, I think it's still up. So if they have your size, then grab one, dude. This one I got for Christmas, and I believe it came out for Halloween as well. This one is Blitz and Little Stolas. Oops. Uh, I believe it's going the dark of them just, like, chilling with the grimoire, exploring the, like, what Earth has to offer with the little spell. So, this one is glowing the dark as well. So, I believe it's just, like, the planet, the little things glow as well. And maybe, I think maybe the book glows. But don't quote me, I don't think the book was. <laughs> a very, very cute shirt to, to simulate the, the moment when the first, when the two first met. Very nice, very nice. Alright, we're getting to the end of the shirts. Alright, so this one is Summer Angel Dust. I really love the colors that they use on this. So it has like the pinks that Angel Dust is known for. And then they also have like a light blue in there as well. But... I love to eat that. Like, the, the ice cream cone that Angel Dust has, that would be amazing. <laughs> but, really nice shirt. I love the way that they did the design of it. And then, I believe we're on the last one. Good last one. I got this for Christmas, so this was part of the Black Friday merch. I don't know if this was actually like an official Black Friday one, or this was a past design that they brought back for Black Friday. But this shows... Like, Alistair, not sorry, <laughs> stole it, sorry, but the grimoire just cast and spelled. It's very bright, vibrant with just, like, the simple three colors that they used on this. But I really like this sign. Very nice. Very cool. I believe my boy did get me this, because the other one I got for Christmas was my mom, so. So very nice to end the shirts. Alright, so next I'm going to talk about the notebooks. So, I'm going to start off with the first one. There's not a lot of information I can find on this one, but it was official for the, the Shark Robot store. 
but this is a small sketchbook of the the has been crew. It has a little Vaggy and Angel Dust and Charlie and everyone there. Even Nifty's on here as well. Nifty fans won this day. But it also has the same design in the back as well. And, um, I believe this was on Shark Robot at one point. It's no longer. Like, way no longer. But I don't know when this was released, but I got it for like 20 bucks. <laughs> I was like, hell yeah, I'll get this. So, very nice. It's very small compared... Let's bring the other one Put in the corner. Yeah, it's it's pretty small, but it's pretty decent for a little sketchbook just to have as a as a first merch kind of thing. And which, while this is here, this is the last notebook that I have. It's the it's the grimoire off of Stolas's. This is the, the front of it. And this is the back, and it's got a little red little thing that way you can put it in between the pages that. And the one that I have is the line one, but they also have a sketchbook one as well. But very, very nice. And I love when you, I don't know if you can see this well on the camera, but like all the pages together makes it look like they're made out of gold. Like this is like a, like a demon book and everything. So very nice touch. I like that. Alrighty, because there's a lot of them, I'm going to be covering the keychains, the lanyards, and the standees all in one because they come around the same time, so might as well do that. <laughs> Let me see if I can find him. If just there it is. So I believe it was, yeah, it was during the Valentine's Day merch drop of 2022. That's when they introduced the keychain standees and lanyards. So, one of the first standees was this was this one of Angel Dust. Very, very cute. They're all mainly the same where they have like the the character, the the name of the show that they're from, and then they have like the little platform basically being just like this. So I believe the Hasman crew was the first one. I don't I don't remember if the Hasman crew and the Elva crew were really I think they were really simultaneously. So but Angel Dust was, was the only one that I really wanted, so I got him. I'm just going to put him right there on my desk. And then, at that same point, they introduced the lanyards. This was my first lanyard I've ever gotten. And it comes with a little keychain with a little charm. So I still have him. And also, like, if you get multiple, you can just detach them and put them on other ones as well. But I like to keep them together. And then on the lanyard, they also have, like, a simultaneously different angel dusts on there. And they also have, fat, like, a little fat nuggets on there, too. But pretty durable. I the, the, I did wear this for a while, so the the black has turned to, like, a gray on here. But very, very nice. Now I just have it in my room since I'm using a different lanyard now. But very nice. And then with the... Valentine's Day one, they introduced limited edition keychains. So I did pick up the Angel Dust one. And here he is, very nice, very, very cute. He's got a little outfit, and he's all pink. I believe the only one that's left is Vaggie's from last year. So if you like Vaggie, definitely go get her. But this is the only one I wanted, so that's what I got. Okay, and then I believe it was spring when they introduced more lanyards. And more standees, but no keychains yet. No more keychains. This is when we got more of the different crew. This is when Solus was introduced as well as a standee. Look at him, all precious, all with the big boy. He's very dusty <laughs> now that I look at him. He's a little dusty boy now. You go right there. And then Octavia also got a standee from this as well. So there she is, acting all cool. She's also dusty. <laughs> but these these are the two from the drop, and then they also got lanyards. But I from that one I got Octavia's ones first. I've worn her out for a little bit, so like the ends are pretty worn out. But she still has her little charm. And then here is her let me see. There it is. There is her lanyard as well, the different faces that she makes. I really love the color that they use as well. Very, very cute. And then I got this later. It, it was out of stock for a little bit, and then I was cruising the website, and it just came back on. So I was like, oh, I gotta go get this now. And you guys saw it earlier, and it's the Stolas one. This is the one I'm currently using right now. 
so you got little stoluses on there and you still you still have his little charm on here as well so little little happy face for him okay i think that's all i need my keys for was just this okay and then summer rolled around they didn't have any special standees yet for summer but they did release some summer keychains so let me just move these to the ground so i don't knock them over Let's see, let's do this one first. This is Angel Dust's one. They're they're double-sided. I forgot to mention on the other one. They're double-sided. Um, this one just features Angel Dust. I like the little pinks that they use and everything. But very nice. Very nice. And then here is Stolicis. Oh, they're getting warm now. <laughs> He's just on a little beach towel, just chilling. He's just, he's just being a nice little boy. I, lo I love the way they do his legs on it. It's pretty cool. But I had those on my keychain for a little bit. And then and then it was Halloween when they introduced the the different themes. Yeah, the, the different theme standees, which consisted of five. And then different keychains as well. Um, I only got one from the, the Halloween, mainly because I only like Stolas. And I, they had Charlie, Alistair, Frizz, and Luna. So if you got any of those, they're pretty cool. But these, this one's limited edition. So once it sells out, it's gone. But it shows kind of Solus getting into his demon form all nice. All of them have the, uh, like the red circle. So they all match, you know. But very, very cute. Very nice. And I'll just put them right there. And then we got witch theme ones. So here is Angel Dust. Um, Angel Dust did break a bit. He, I was, do, I was at work and he got caught on one of the things I was doing, so he ripped. So, but he's repaired now. But he's he's a little shorter than he's supposed to be. <laughs> but it shows him on a broom being a witch. Oh, and they're also like um, I forgot what the word that he used for it, but he's, he's a little bit of like a little shine to the light and everything. And then we have Stolas as well. This is the actual length they're supposed to be, because he didn't break. But he's got his little spells, he's a little cast in fire. They all use the same, um, what I really do appreciate is if you do get, like, a set of these, they all use the same color so they all fit in nicely. So, that's a big plus. That's a big, big plus. And then finally for Black Friday, their first wave, I believe they came out with these one-time run characters. That were a little popular, but not popular enough to do like a full production. So I did end up getting this little Octavia. It's like three inches tall. Because the other ones are like six inches. So she's like really tiny. She's like almost the height of this. But I love the detail that they have for the character. Like the little white at the ends of their hairs. Because she's like a young owlette. And her original dress is really cute as well. So she's she's a nice asset. I didn't think they would ever get one of these, so definitely a nice plush. And then after they did that, they released a Black Friday draw part two, where they had standees based off of certain scenes from Hasbun Hotel and Hell of a Boss. So I had those. So first one I got was Angel Dust. Now he sold out super quick, which I see why. It shows some featured in the Attic music video. So, very, very nice. And then this one is based off of episode 7 of season 1 of Hell of a Boss when Blitz and Stolas go to Ozzy's on a date. But it was really fun sending these things up instead of just being like, boop, boop, you know? And then the final one that I have is this one. It is the circus scene from episode 2 of season 1, so I love to give him a little head. And then what's that is his like, sniper gun with him as well. I just love they featured Octavian. I didn't expect them to, so that was nice. And they released a couple of keychains for this one too. I believe this one was in the first drop, which I forgot to mention. They did holiday theme ones, and I have all... My boy has two of them, and I have two of them. So I have just the the Hasman crew all on like a Christmas tree. I love how they kind of included their new designs a little bit, especially Faggies looks like it's the new design a little bit, trying to be subtle on that. And then Angel Dust is right there, you know, cute. 
And then Nifty's up there as well. Nifty fans won again. But it's really nice. And then the other one that I have is Blitz and Stolas. Just being a nice little couple on a wreath. They're also double-sided, just to let you know. But these, these, I don't think they're no longer available. They sold out pretty quickly, especially this one. Alright, and then this isn't a complete collection. I did have Stolas at one point. But he came off of my, like, keychain just out of nowhere. Because I thought he broke off, so I was trying to find the little ring. So he just fell. I don't know where he fell to, but rest in peace. So hopefully they um come out with another one of those, or else I'm going to have to get that second hand. Alright, so this one is the Octavian one. I They're all limited, limited stock, so hopefully they come back out. So that one's Octavia. They're all double-sided as well. I love the art that they use for it. Yeah, and then they had the same art for Angel Dust as well. When you're just hanging them by the hair, you're just chilling. Let's see if I can stand them up straight. A nice bow tie. The, and they're both double-sided. And that should be everything of the standees. The lanyards and the keychains. Alright, so just to take a quick intermission, we're going to do the pins. Just the jumbo pins for right now, and then we'll move on to, I believe, the mugs and the playmats, and that should be it for everything. And then we get into the pins, what you guys actually came here for. <laughs> Alright, so let's find the first one. Here it is. So the first jumbo pin was actually released in summer of 2022, and it was of the moment from episode 2 of season 1 of Stolas' Lullaby. So it just shows that nice moment. Let me take it out. Yeah, they all come in a collector's box. Uh, some were damaged more than others, but, but it's kind of very nice. You can see a bit of a of the glitter around the edges as well. This is a nice, very nice. And you like some of the, I don't know if you can see it very well on the sides, but some of the metal pops up and everything, especially for Octavia. That way it has like layers to it as well. Alright, and then the next ones that I got was from the Halloween one. They had four limited edition ones. But I got this one. This one is Stolas and his Dion Four in a nice blue background. The on closer inspection, it does look like his like his demon seal right there. Or just like very decorative, so but very nice. It does have glitter in there as well. Uh, I forgot to mention for the spring line, they introduced a lot of the newer pins. So they did a glitter line and then they did like a spinning one. I don't have any of the spinning ones because none of the characters that were spinning was ones that I like. So, But you can see on there that some of the red and the, the yellow are glitter. Especially on like the demon right there. So... Very nice. And then for the last ones that at least that they have for right now, they released on part two of Black Friday, where they released like four limited edition, which I have two of them, and then two normal edition ones when I just have one. So these are actually pretty cool. This one is Angel Dust and it's stained glass. So let me see if I can take it out and show you guys. But it's supposed to be if you put light through it, then the parts that have the glass, you can actually get light through it. So it has like that glass kind of feel like you get at like a church. But you can probably see. Yeah, I think um, if you go on the Shark Robots Twitter, someone made this beautiful setup where they had all four pins on like this board. And they had lights like taped around to like the backside. So when they turned it on, the, the the different lights would peer through, and it made it like like super cool. One, I probably only do that if one I had extras, and two if I had the whole set, because it wouldn't just be weird just to have two. But I like my pins the way they are; they're cute and in the box. <laughs> and then there's Stolas. They also did the Stolas one as well. Um, I believe it was, it was Alistair, Angel Dust, Luna, and Stolas that they did for this as well. So hopefully they'll release more for other people to get as well. But this one has the same effect where if the light shines through, then it'll be cool and everything. <laughs> okay, and then the last jumbo pin that I have 
is when Stolas met Blitz for the first time during the circus episode. So you have, like, Baby Frizz and Little Blitz as well, and then Little Stolas there. It's just normal, um, it just has, like, the normal metal in there. No glitter, no special things in there, just, just, just the metal the way it is. Now, if you got the Frizz one, I believe that one glows in the dark, so that one's actually pretty cool. So, but... Yep, that's all the um, the jumbo pins that I have that have been released up to date. So let me just put that there so it doesn't get ruined. Just out of the way. Alright, so next I'm going to go through the mugs that I have. And I just gathered them all. <laughs> I have a lot. I didn't realize how many I had. So I'm going to try to do this in order one release. But, okay, I see the first one that was released. Alright, so the first mug that was released was actually in... It was during the holiday Black Fridays of 2021. And that's when they had their first mug. So you got like little Stolas right there. Um, them all together as a couple. And then you have Blitz on a sled. Now this is when they did just the couple one. So it was this. They had Moxie and Millie. And they had Charlie and Vaggy. So they had just had a couple ones for the holidays as well. This one's really cute. I think it was a good starting point for them doing mugs. So definitely got a lot of uses out of this one. Alright, let me see if I can find the next one. <laughs> Alright, the next mug that was released was for Valentine's Day, where it shows the couples. It was the same three couples listed before, but actually they included Ozzy and Frizz. So if you got that one, that's pretty cool. Um, but it shows, like, Blitz and Solas holding a heart, and then coming together just to be a nice couple. I do like that this one's definitely better than the other one. They, it seems like they learned from, like, the sizing, at least. So let me see. Like the, the, like these two blitzes look the same size, but they look the same size as well. But maybe it's just like the when they come into the middle and everything. Yeah, this one's definitely bigger. Maybe it's just the way that I'm looking at. It. <laughs> but I, th I think this is definitely an improvement from last the last time they made a mug. Okay, and then springtime was next, and this is when they introduced a bunch of mugs of just like one character being featured. And I think they've added two more in on Black Friday, so some of these have been discontinued. At least the ones that I have haven't been discontinued, so that's good. So the first one that was released, well, they're all released at the same time, but the first one I grabbed was Stolas. There's a little Stolas right there, another pose, and then it just has like a headshot. It's kind of like the same for all of them. And then we have Angel Dust. Little pose right there, and then a little him sitting. And then a headshot. And the last two that I have for the spring collection is Octavia right here doing a little pose. Then another little pose and then a headshot. I feel smirky. And then they have Fat Nuggets. Now I like this one a lot. So it has them like little running and then it has some little sitting and it has a little cute one. I, I cannot wait to see Fat Nuggets in the, in the show. I know it comes out in summer but I cannot wait. Hopefully they, they don't change them up too much, you know? Okay, the next one I have is for the Summer Drop. It just has a little Lululand, so it has, like, Robo Frizz on there. And then on the other side, they have, like, the M Crew plus Octavia and Stolas just riding one of the roller coasters as well. Uh, it's really nice. It's kind of like what you would get at a normal theme park for, like, Disney or Universal. So, very, very nice memorabilia of that episode as well. Uh, unfortunately, I cannot find my Summer one. <laughs> I think it's downstairs somewhere, but I'm not going to rummage through trying to find it. But it has Stolas and Blitz in the little summer things, and they come together, and so really cute. But I really hope I can find it later. <laughs> that was really nice. <laughs> All right. And then for Halloween, they stopped doing the couple ones, and they just it's focused on the crew at that point. So I was able to pick up these. Thank God I wasn't a fan, like, that too much of a fan of, like, the main and crew, because I would have had to buy five mugs instead of two so so for this one it's just like the M crew you got a little angel dust and a little fat nuggets wearing a little little witch hat and then it shows Charlie and Vaggy and then a little husk and Alistair on there as well. No nifty. You do not get nifty this time. A little alligator thing on there too. I think that's just the brand of mugs that they used. But I love the black. It's all like all the all the mugs over here are white. So this was a really nice change for, like, the nice black for Halloween. And then this one is the Imp Crew doing the whole trick-or-treat thing as well. 
And it has Moxie, Millie, Blitz, Luna, and then what I bought it for was Little Stolas right here. He is so cute. I think it looks like the same design from when they did the mug. Almost, almost the same design. They almost did have the same design. <laughs> okay, we're almost we're almost at the end of the mugs. So these ones are for Christmas or the just the, the holidays. But actually, this one does have Nifty on. This one's the has been. The has been crew one. Then you got Nifty, Charlie, Baggy, Alistair, Husk, and Angel and Fat Nuggets on there. Husk has a bottle of liquor in his hands, I just realized. But Angel and Fat Nuggets look so cute. But some of them are like a little like a little bit festive, but like some of them have scarves. Just 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 Charlie has a scarf. But and then this one's cute as well. It just has them all Hanging out, doing hot, like drinking hot chocolate. So you got Luna, Moxie, Millie, Blitz, and then you have Octavia and Stolas on there as well. But he's just being real cute, just drinking hot chocolate and enjoying the holidays. Moxie's got a little cute green sweater on there as well. Luna's got like a nice like shirt. But they went a lot more on this one than they did in that one. They just like shoved the characters and added the the decor, and they're like, alright, that, that's good enough. <laughs> right, and the last mug that I have is from the Black Friday drop, and it has little Stolas on there, and then little Stolas and little Blitz coming together with some memorabilia, and then little Blitz on the side. That one's really cute. I don't, I don't like, I don't like Blitz that much. Maybe like a solid B, like B tear for me, but that that one's like really cute. <laughs> I love like it shows the warm horse and little Paimon on there as well. It's really cute. And you, oh yeah, you got the grimoire too. So very nice to do the moment again of them meeting. So very nice. 10 out of 10. Okay, so before we get into the playmats, I'm actually going to show you my most expensive thing from the actual Shark Robot website. It's this. <laughs> now, I, I don't know how to skate at all. I, I won't try. I'm, I'm a poser. So I just have this little stolus. Oh, almost dropped too. <laughs> But it's the Sorry Night one. I believe he's still available if you want to get him. But really, really cute. Nice wood. It didn't come with any wheels or anything, so you gotta do all that yourself. But here's what the normal front looks like for what you actually skate on. But the bottom looks like this. This was a pain to put on the wall. <laughs> I think we just, um... Yeah, I can see the mark. We drilled, like, here and put it sideways. Let me see if I can find the mark. Probably on like this side, but we hung them up like like this in my office. So very nice, very cool. And then finally, we'll get into the play mats, and then we'll do pins. Which I know you guys wanted me to do the pins. That's probably what you're here for. <laughs> so I just pulled a random one. All right. So first we have from the Black Friday drop of 2022. We have just Stolas and Blitz making cookies together. They're all shaped like little horses as well. Fortunately, I didn't get to use this one right before I left my job, so I generally just put it underneath my Wii U and just have it there. Um, I might change it out because the the Valentine's Day one just got announced and they have a Stolas and an Angel Dust one as well. So, I don't know. Hopefully when I get all my stuff in, I'll do another review where I show them off and everything. So, hopefully I can use this <laughs> at some point again. Alright, next one. Now this one's really cute. It shows... Let me see. It shows Stolas and Octavia just chilling at their little mansion. And them having some nice holiday time together. So it shows like them decorating a Christmas tree. And Stolas taking some selfies with his daughter. It's very, very cute. I'm glad Octavia got like a nice, like, limited edition uh, play mat. Oh, that's good. She's not sure. Speaking of Octavia, uh, I have this one of her. This was spring, I believe, when they brought some some of the designs in. So it just shows her just on the playmat, all nice. So I'm glad I got this one. So I definitely use this in my office. She has like actually she she actually looks pretty. Good. It's my uh, angel dust one where I kept eating food off of it. So you have like some noodle stains. So. But this one's pretty good. I had her underneath my, my other computer for a little bit. Now this one's really cool. Um, this one was for the 
Halloween drop of 2022. It shows Demon Stolas there with his other form. I love how cool this is. Like, he looks so determined here. He's casting his little spell with his hands. He's like, like it looks like from his hand in his back. Like, if you had no context that this is actually his demon form, it looks like he's actually summoning a demon. So, it's very, very cool. Very nice, nice art. I'd use it on my nightstand. <laughs> so, very, very nice. Let's see. Let's do Angel for once. Angel is coming in here now. Now, this is Angel Dust from the summer of 2022. Very nice. I love how all the. At least it is for, like, this one, the Valentine's Day one. They use, like, the same colors. That way, if you do collect the set, it all looks nice together. So, I do love that. You'll see in a second when I pull out the Stolas one. But I love, like, they didn't try to alter, like, the pink that he already is. So, so it's a nice light blue background. A little bit of the darker blue right here. The blue-green. So, so pretty. Look at the pretty boy. All right. And then here is the Summer Stolas one. Like I said, it has like the same colors, but it shows him just kind of like posing really nice. I love the They made the shorts, the, the colors. Yeah. Oh, wait, hold on. Let me look at this again. <laughs> oh, yeah, his whole body's pink. Yeah. Yeah, and his swim, like bathing suits are the, is the pink. But here he made him like a dark pink and had like a light blue pants as well. So very cute. Very, very good. And then the last one that I have for now is the Angel Dust one of Valentine's Day of 2022. This is when I first started collecting playmats, so I thought this one was super cool. This was limited edition. So yeah, you can definitely see it's gotten some some use. This part's definitely, I don't think you can see it well on the camera, but this part's definitely darker because I kept eating food off of it, <laughs> so. But a very nice playmat, nonetheless. Angel Dust is still my absolute favorite, 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 favorite boy. And that should do it for all the playmats. And now, it's pin time. Okay, so these two boards have my entire collection. Like, this one's full, and this one has, like, ten. <laughs> So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put them on this cork board to s display them in like their, like when they were released, so like the 2019s, like the Valentine's Day era, the summer era, and whatnot, so it's easier to follow along that way, because I don't want you guys to get lost, so I'm not showing you guys, because I want you to be surprised. Let me... Maybe you be careful. Oh, they poke right through the side. Okay. And at least after this, I can rearrange my pin board. And where's the other one? Yeah. Okay, so the first ones that I have were released in 2019. And. I'm going to try hiding these two. So the first one I want to show you guys is the Angel Dust Portrait Pin. So, there he is. He was extremely rare. He was released around Halloween, I believe. Along with this other pin as well. This was like a Day of the Day, day of the Dead pin. So there was a Vaggy one and an Angel Dust. There was Angel Dust, Vaggy, and Alistair. There was no Vaggy. There was no Charlie. Sorry. <laughs> But they did have portraits of the the main Hasman crew, and I believe they had like two other ones, but they're not Angel Dust, so I don't worry about them. And finally, this one was the first pin to ever be released as merch, and it had Angel Dust on it, so I knew I had to grab it. So after months of trying to find one at a reasonable price, I found one, <laughs> and it is the the 2019 Valentine's Day one featuring Angel Dust and a heart. Now, this one was the first one. There was barely any information on it, but I'm glad I have it now. A little bit of a flex, but I do have it. <laughs> but I'm really, I'm really proud of it. So it, it was, it was a, a stride in my collection. But I believe I wasn't really counting on it because it was really rare and not a lot were made, I believe. But I'm glad I have it. And then I believe I'm missing just a few from the from the Angel Dust side of the collection. Stolas and Octavia and I believe Fat Nuggets are complete. 
but I'm just missing, I believe, the Addict music video one for Angel Dust and the the Skull, like the, the Candy Skull one where that goes in the dark. Those are the only two pins that I'm missing, and that'll be complete for the Angel Dust side. For now, because, you know, they always release new stuff, so... Maybe I should just, like, sew them off all together. Yeah, maybe I should just go light and do this one first before I overwhelm you guys. So, here's some of the pins that didn't fit on my other one. So, these were the die heart, the, the die antique ones. They were released on Black Friday, I believe, of 2022. That doesn't seem right now that I say it out loud. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, I'm really trying to think. Maybe it's 2021. Yeah, 2021 feels right. Yeah, it's 2021. I don't know why I had to think about it. Yeah, so these are released in 2021. So it, it has Fat Nuggets, Angel Dust, Stolas, Little Octavia, and Big Octavia here as well. Um, here is Stolas. I didn't get this on release. I had to get it secondhand since it was impossible. But I found it pretty cheap, so I like grabbed it as soon as possible. But this is like a Stolas portrait of him. I think it was like right when the, the pilot got released as well. And then I have the heart theme ones as well. These were for, I believe, Black Friday of 2020. And then they released like a bunch of these later on. So I was lucky to get, a, get all of these. I don't think any of them are available now, unfortunately. But there, there's a couple of the heart ones still, if you can find them. And then, I, I hate to overwhelm you guys, but this is, like, an entire board of pins. I'll try to, like, section them off, but it's kind of hard to. But, here you go. So, this is really heavy. <laughs> so, these right here are the changing portraits. I try to keep them all together. So, this one is from Halloween 2022, along with this one and this one. Uh, it has Stolas and his daughter, and then these as well feature them. And then these ones were the first ever ch changing portrait pins. Now, I'm glad to have these. That's really cool, especially the Angel Dust one. And then the Stolas one as well. That one's really cute. Cute, cute boys. Very cute boys. And then up here we have the some of the summer ones as well from 2022. We have Octavia. Uh, Stolas and Blitz. This one's no longer available, but this one is if you guys want to go grab it. Stolas on his little tube. We got Fat Nuggets right here on his little playmat as well. Where's the other ones? Aha. Uh -huh. There is Angel Dust right here on his little floaty. And I thought there was one more, but maybe I just missed counting. Yeah, I just scanned. There's no more. Okay. So... So here are the ones that were from the Black Friday drop of 2022. They did these really cool ones called the rainbow plated ones. So if you shine them to the light, they do different colors. Now I am glad I got the Angel Dust one and Octavia one first. Because that was like the first ones I was like, I need to get these. Because I usually, when they first release a drop, I usually go and just get four pins that I really like. And I knew I would regret not getting later. And then I saw their tweet saying there was only like 100 left of each of them. And I was like, perfect. I don't have to worry about it. I don't have to rush to check out or anything. So, and then this one just sold out, the Stolas one. But I'm glad I got these two. Glad I got these. And then this one was also one of the ones that sold out first. So I had to go actually go back and go get this one along with the thing I got them with the little Stolas right here. Little cute Stolas. Um, where's the other ones? The baby Stolas right here. Um, here's normal Stolas. And that's all the ones that I got. Yeah, yeah. Oh, big one right here. This little Blitz and Stolas reading. That one's cute. And then we have some of our Valentine's Day ones of 2022. And it had like these heart shaped ones featuring couples. So it had like Stolas and Blitz. There was Maggie and Charlie. Uh, Moxie and Millie. They did, had a heartbreak one of Blitz and. Uh, Brassica. And they did this nice friendly one with Stolas and his daughter, like little Octavia down there. So that was really cute. So I'm glad Octavia got into a pin for Valentine's Day. And then they did some of the pinup ones. So this is when Stolas got his first pinup. And it's this one right here of him just pouring wine with a little rope kind of coming down. And then Angel Dust got one as well. That one's really cute. Really, really cute. 
And then this one was the first ever one of Angel Dust. It's, it's very long. It, it's like, it really stands out. Yeah, because it, it's like super long compared to the other ones released during that time. This one came out in 2021, so... I'm glad I was able to find someone selling it at a reasonable price, so... Very, very cute boy. Um, and then we have Summer of 2021 as well. This one, they had the, the swimsuit of Solus here. And they had a lot of Angel Dust stuff, so... so they had normal Angel Dust right here. Then they had uh, Angel Dust with Fat Nuggets. And then they had, a, like, a pair, almost, but they weren't sold as a pair of Angel Dust and Fat Nuggets right here. Oh, and I forgot, I just noticed it as well. Um, they had an Angel Dust Cutie one. That one's still available, but it's limited edition. That one's really cute. Uh, speaking of limited edition, for spring they released a, an Angel Dust Attic one, like a new brand new Attic one. So that one's really cute. They also had, uh, they, they weren't paired, like, they weren't sold together, but it was a pair, so you get, like, a Angel Dust one and a Cherry one, but the Cherry one sold out pretty quickly, so. So hopefully everyone got the Angel Dust one if they really wanted it. And then, oh, we should cover the Halloween stuff now, so. So I believe this one came out in 2021 of the, this is when I started doing my collection, so. This one is Stolas, like Demon Stolas. And then this one was 2022 Halloween. So this one does go in the dark. And then these came out during that time as well. So it has like the witches, and I believe they're eight. And then I, this one was also part of it as well. Cute little fat nuggets there. Being cute. And then part of 2021 Halloween, they had a witch collection where they had the girls being witches. And then they had Octavia right here. This is like huge, really big. Oh, and they also, this one, like, stole was really shiny, because, I mean, like, he is a demon, so I guess that seems why he's very really popular for Halloween. They also had a little Stolas and little Octavia right there. Very cute. Mm. Trying to think of what to talk about next. <laughs> oh, and they had Fat Nuggets there, too, for 2021 as well. Now, I did lose that pin by accident. I had it on my back, and then I got home, and I couldn't find him anywhere. He just fell off, so... I just had to get a second hand. Luckily, this one is the legit one because they are people are selling them that aren't legit. So be aware of that if you do go get one. Um, these were also part of the Black Friday of 2021. So it has like the life size ones. So it's like little Octavia, um, big Octavia, and Stolas right there, and then Angel Dust right there, and then where's Fat Nuggets? Fat Nuggets right there. And then, I, I don't know when they started releasing these, but they had some of the other ones as well. So they have, like, Gangster Angel Dust right there. They had Stolas' Calling with his little phone. He, they did a lot with him with the phone. Uh, head of Stolas, then the head of Angel Dust, and here's Fat Nuggets as well. Um, they also, this is when they started doing pairs, so I just have one of each, and I gave them away to a friend. But I just have Angel Dust as a little tiki shrink. Um, there's the zombie Angel Dust there as well. There's the cutie one. And then I think that's all that I have for them at least. Oh, and the cookie cutter one. That one was there for a while, and it finally sold out. And then... For the ones that were paid through the plushies, here is the Angel Dust and Fat Nuggets one. That one was really cute. I'm lucky that one never fell off, because if it did, I think I would cry. Um, and then we have the plushie ones for Stolas and Octavia. I did get Frizz, but I gave that to a friend, so they would appreciate it. So it has Stolas with his little hat from Lululand, and it shows a scene from Octavia drawing Lululand as well, of her just getting mad. Um... Oh, here's a little Octavia one that was released in summer. That one does have the glitter on there, and then this one was an inspiration from that as well. Uh, I don't think this one ever was re-released, re so glad I got that one. And then these portrait pins were for 2021, and it just kind of completed the collection. So you got Princess Octavia, and you got little Octavia, and it's supposed to be Stella holding her. So I guess Stella made her way in my collection. Um, then they did these hanging ones as well. So you got a little tail right there that kept moving. 
So this is the base of it, and then this little tail that keeps moving. And then you got little Octavia. Just her head has the, the pin back thing, so her body kind of like... Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. And then... And then this is that same moment that was on my on my t-shirt right now of the one from episode two. So I'm glad they got that moment in. They're really milking that moment. <laughs> and I'm just scanning through. I think I talked about all the pins on here. Oh, and here's the, the head of Octavia. Right there. But I'll just show it to you guys one more time just in case I haven't talked about anything. Just so you guys can get another looksies. Which, yeah. This is my entire collection, and it's, like, surrounding me at this rate. But I do hope you guys enjoyed. Hopefully, maybe I can do a video when I eventually move. I can show you guys me, like, organizing my stuff and setting it up exactly how I want, so. But I forgot to mention this at the beginning. But I do collect also Moxie stuff from my boy as well, because that's his favorite character. And I don't have it right now. The only thing I have was that switch case, which I was lucky to even have during this section. So I believe, probably like right here, I'll have the photo up so you guys can look at it. But it has like the pins that he has and the couple of like loose stuff. So like the keychains and the sandies and that one mug that I got him. So that'll be like over here. <laughs> but I do appreciate you guys watching this. Hope you guys did enjoy seeing my collection of what I had. So hopefully when I do get the Valentine's Day stuff in, I can show that off to you guys as well. So I hope you guys enjoy. And just let me know what, what would you like to see me do next. Have a good day. Bye-bye.